Hello YouTubers, uh, it's been a long while since I uh, uh, posted a new videos on YouTube but here I am again with a small device, it's a SGM32 Primer 1 from Resonance it's got an ARM Cortex M3 uh, MCU in here with 128 kilobytes of uh, flash and 20 kilobytes of ROM it's got a 3 axis accelerometer and a buzzer, a button and that's about it but it's because it's a development board it's easy to take apart <laughs> yeah and as you can see here it's got the debugging and programming USB and the application USB so it's a R-Link uh, E-Tag device uh, in built in on the device and here's the CPU the accelerometer and uh, the charging circuit for the battery actually it has been so hot so it's melted a little bit I don't know it must be something wrong but uh, 12, 12 megahertz uh, oscill uh, crystal oscillator and the buzzer speaker as I told you and an expansion port because uh, you got a built-in real time clock but uh, I'm not using it for time being it's include a circle OS a circle operating system for this circle because it's a circle operating system because it's an operating system with operating system you can uh, download uh, several applications and uh, start them independently from the uh, OS so you get the full CPU power on your programs but I don't like to use the circle OS because I want my application to start up at once but uh, well right now I have a small graphics library built in, not with text, just uh, circle, uh, rectangle, field rectangle, field circle and uh, eclipse and field eclipse and uh, polygon writing I can show you if I start it up it will be fast now yeah, if I push the button again you will see the eclipse as you can see it's a filled circle with the outer line eclipse polygon and the house so it's from the resonance as you can see here it's a sheep device so that you can find find it on eBay, and uh, with it comes a USB cable, a CD-ROM, and well, of course, the device, and the RAID 7, which is a IDE for developing your programs in C code. And here's the Polyhouse, <laughs> which looks like this. And uh, well, it's really really simple to work with not like the LPC ARM7 cores this is much easier but uh,